Here's another form of frost control, flood irrigation. What we saw previously was sprinkler irrigation. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a slight steam rising from this water. And that occurs when the water is warmer than the ambient air temperature. And this is what we're looking for in the water for frost protection. The water is releasing the heat that it has stored into the atmosphere, which in turn warms the air. Here's a young uh, citrus grove. Uh, it's still currently about 28 degrees. They're still running water, but you can see the icicles that formed and all the ice from the irrigation water uh, surrounding the base of the tree. If you look at these trees closely, they look a little sad. The leaves are curled. They got a slight gray look. They don't have that real vibrant look to them. Uh, this is, area was a lot colder than the previous areas. And this is frost damage to the actual leaf of the tree. Uh, had this had wind machines, possibly it wouldn't have seen this much damage. But as young as they are, it, didn't, it wasn't cost effective to install a wind machine at the price of $50,000 per machine.